For sure you can. I have some questions to ask you. Okay, Daddy, listening. How does it feel to be my dad? How does it feel to be your dad? Wow. Well, I feel honored to be your dad. Um, Daddy feel like I was blessed when I had you. I mean, I think any parent will feel blessed to have a child, but I just think that for you, in the time that you came, you came into this world at a very, very important time in my life. I think that you had a lot to do with saving my life. So I'd just like to call you my little special princess. You know, your birth actually ignited something in me to want to live. Call you my mini me, you know that. <laughs> you my little mini me, so daddy love you. Uh, I'm just blessed, man. I thank God every day for you, for your existence. Okay, I have some. I have another question for you. Okay. What's the hardest part about being my daddy? The hardest part about being your daddy? Well, I would probably have to say. The time that I invest into your track career. I mean, it's not easy doing what I do, baby. I invest a lot of time into you. I invest a lot of resources, a lot of energy. Time, period. I mean, it's a blessing to me, but it's at times it becomes overwhelming. I mean, if you think about it, I've actually arranged my entire life to focus around you. Everything about me bleeds de Cheney. My thoughts are focused on your future. My thoughts are focused on your journey. So when I think about what's hard, it's just staying consistent. It's not that it's hard. What I do is being consistent at it. Not falling off track, not being detoured or derailed from worldly things. I focus on you and I stay in that lane. I actually wrote out a blueprint for your life. And it's my job to see you through it. Baby, you're gonna learn when you get older that as adults, life will throw curveballs at you. Life will hurt you. Life will complicate the things that matter to you. And I think that's where the complicated part comes in. Staying on track while you're weathering the storm. But you know my motto, can't stop, won't stop. And I'ma see you to the end of your journey. Okay, Daddy, you ready for the next one? Yes, babe. Why do you have tears under your eyes? I'll just leave you with this. When daddy was growing up, daddy was living a certain way, and daddy was involved in things that, let's say, aren't things he should have been involved in. Daddy's been through a lot of hurt and pain growing up, baby. Daddy's seen a lot of things, been in a lot of things. Daddy had to survive growing up. You know the conversations that we always have about you being nine and when I was nine and the differences and how we had to live? Remember those conversations when I told you when I was a child what my life was like and how your life is today and that you should be thankful? Without it explaining, these teardrops represent a lot of pain, baby. I'm going to leave you with that one.
a lot of pain, but that's the beautiful thing about having babies. That's why I actually count and rely on you. I mean, you know, I am your father, so I know you count on me and you rely on me, but don't think for one second that I don't need you just as much as you need going you keep me strong and there's nothing daddy won't do for you there's no chance I won't take for you I've sacrificed a lot I've given up a lot from the time my eyes open up in the morning to when they close at night it's my sole obligation to protect you your sisters and your brother to lead by example because I want y'all to be proud of me as your father I don't want y'all to grow up and find out that the man that your father used to be I'm glad that y'all get to grow up and experience the man that your father is today because there will come a time baby father was but just know no matter what I got your back I got your front and I will protect you I love you I love you too daddy okay last but not least this is a very special question okay I'm ready Why do I love you? Well, I love you because I made you. And although you are a young lady, I look at you as the female version of me. I mean, when I think about you, I see myself in some ways. I see the same young athlete that I once was, with the same drive and the same leadership skills. You don't know how amazing it is to me to watch you out there and see you perform. See, Shanae, what you don't understand is that you represent to me everything that I didn't accomplish. I want you to go next level with this thing. Daddy forfeited his opportunity to do something athletic. Daddy made bad choices. My athletic career was shut down short. That's why I invest so much time and energy into you now, because I want you to get it. I want you to do it right. Your foundation is set for you, Shanae. Daddy didn't have a foundation when he was growing up. Daddy did what he wanted. Daddy was in an unstable home. Daddy didn't have a, a solid foundation. And because of those things that I didn't have, I know what you need. I'm your biggest fan. I know what hurts, so I know what not to give you. I know what feels good, so I know what to teach you. You just keep running, baby girl. You keep running. representing for not just yourself but for your family we all count on you my whole life is about you make us all proud and most importantly make yourself proud you're a very special little girl you get to do things that the average nine-year-old girl don't get to do you've been in places that a lot of those nine-year-old girls don't get to go When I see you, I see the future. And the foundation that I'm laying down now, I believe that that's gonna get you to the destination. Just stay on board with me, baby. Please. You're gonna get older. New things are gonna come at you. New temptations. Stick to the foundation, baby. Stay away from the 
mad stuff. Stay close to home. Learn from your father's mistakes. I'm counting on you, baby. You're my shining star. My little warrior princess. You make my heart beat. I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Can daddy have a kiss? Daddy, you so silly. <laughs> That's alright. I'll be silly for you, though. But hold on, though. Don't go nowhere. Now, daddy, I got a question for you. You got a question for me? Okay, daddy, let's hear it. When you look at your father, and you see my face, all these tattoos on my face, and you look at my eyes, I want you to honestly tell me what you see. I see a lot of love in you, daddy.